Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ray, that's Koji, and today well, we're gonna look at the new treasure booster set and see if it's worth it. But before we get to checking out this new product that I'm very excited uh, for, I want to quickly tell you about today's giveaway. So for this video, I'm going to be giving away one of the Pro Me, um, Luffy promo from this set. And all you have to do to be part of that giveaway is make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. I will post the winner this Saturday. So make sure you say subscri subscribe so that you don't miss it if you actually win. Uh, also, I want to quickly shout out the members of my Wolfpack, pack. And as a reminder, my members only giveaway for this month is going to be the Sabo Alt Art. And all you have to do to be part of this giveaway is become a member for the month of September. All right, now without further ado, yeah, let's go check out this new product. All right, so the tr One Piece Treasure Booster Set is a new product that's um, been created by Bandai as a way for new people or just uh, have uh, more opportunities for people to actually open it up uh, older sets. Um, so what's included in this product is going to be a random uh, assortment of packs from OP01 to OP05. I believe it's going to be four distinct packs, so there's no chance of you to doubling up. So you're not going to get four OP04. It's going to be four different packs in this one, as well as one uh, promo card. There you go. Uh, I believe the promo card is going to be a Luffy one, so I can't wait to actually check it out to see what it looks like. So this one, um, it has an MSRP of uh, 20 US dollars up here in Canada. I bought this at Walmart online. I got it for 35 US dollars. Obviously, Canadians got shafted with the exchange rate, but it is what it is. I wanted to check it out, and it's been a while since I opened older sets, so it's going to be fine with me. Um, in terms of... Um, uh, talking about uh, of the value prep um, preposition of this product. Well, usually if you buy um, the older sets um, per pack, it's going to be around $4.20 USD each. So if you buy four random packs, it's going to be around $16.50. Um, so obviously it's, you know, having this product is more than that value. You know, it does contain uh, Luffy promo cards. So if you value that card as two uh, to five dollars, then maybe this one's worth it. Um, however, that's only at MSRP. Obviously, OP01, OP02, and so forth are definitely way more expensive now than they were when they released. So actually, if you buy this one um, at MSRP prices, uh, a treasure booster set. Uh, it's still much cheaper to do this than actually buying those um, packs uh, at uh, inflated prices currently. So, yeah, I think it's a great value for what it is. Obviously, a lot of it is going to be gambling. All of it is going to be completely random. So in that sense, it's it's good because you know that you're not going to get ripped. Um, but it's bad because you're not guaranteed anything. So we're going to check it out, see which packs we get, and see if we get lucky and see the promo. All right. So let's go check it out. Oh, I'm so excited. It's been a while. I, I started, if you guys are just new to the channel or um, if you did not know, I've been um, started my channel since OP01. Uh, I opened like so many boxes of those. So it's been a while since I actually check out any of these packs. And uh, yeah, I'm so excited to s open some of them and see if we get um, uh, actually uh, lucky. All right. So this is our packs so the first box that we got we got the promo there you go you got the promo luffy we'll go look at that more in depth and then here are the four packs we got op01 i'm so excited uh, about this one so this one is going to be the uh post errata uh one so it's going to be the white bottom so if you're curious about that so it will not include pre errata cards so i'll keep that in mind we have op03 there you go. It'd be nice to pull Katakuri here. We have OP04. It'd be nice to get Lua, uh, Sabo SR. That'd be pretty cool. And then obviously, let's go grab some Manga Luffy. Um, I will take another um, Manga or Oda Sign Luffy uh, as well. And uh, so yeah, so I think that's a pretty, pretty good um, 
assortment of packs uh, no op02 so far and obviously the more op01 that i get i think that will be pretty pretty awesome i believe the only card that i have not pulled from all my op01 videos are law law alt art so that would be pretty cool to actually grab that all right so here's our second box uh here's the luffy promo again oh there you go our first op02 pack and then we have op03 op04 and then op05 so uh so you can see uh both packs uh you were able to get three four and five and then you get you got uh either op01 or op02 obviously i think they value op01 or two as the premium packs in this set and then the other three are three four five uh, I don't know if you can get one, two, three, and four. Um, you know, maybe it's all random that way. But yeah, so these are going to be all the packs that we're going to be opening for this video. Uh, that's pretty awesome. But before that, let's quickly look at this promo. So this is a promo that's going to be um, part of this um, booster set if you buy it. And look at that. It looks absolutely gorgeous. So this is going to be from ST10 Luffy. Uh, so this is the Rush Luffy um 10 cost 11k uh once per turn when your opponent activates a blocker you can k up to one of your opponent's characters with 8k power or less but look at the gorgeous artwork guys look at that you got Sa you got sabo you got ace uh and oh man the three brothers and honestly if you're a collector i don't know in terms of playability of this card but if you are a collector if you're pa a fan of one piece look at this I think this is definitely worth five US dollars and that makes the rest of the packs well worth it for this price. And look at that guys. It looks absolutely gorgeous. As, uh, as I said before, uh, I'm giving one of these away. So make sure to hit the like button, subscribe and leave a comment down below so that you're going to be part of that giveaway. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Looking absolutely gorgeous. Um, yeah, so now let's go look at and uh, open these packs. So I think what I'll do is I'll open OP04 first, 3, 5, 2, and 1. That's how I feel the value of the sets are. Uh, so we'll open with 4. We're gonna, then we're going to do 3. Then we're going to open 5, 2, and 1. So that's going to be pretty, pretty good order. And uh, so yeah, so you get four of these packs. Uh, all of it is going to be random. Uh, so I said before, one of the, I guess, um, sucky part of this set is that, or, or or this product is that it's all completely random. So you you are not guaranteed anything. Same thing as buying blisters, or say some same thing as buying double pack, um, you know, sets. However, this is so much so much better than buying loose uh, boosters from Facebook or eBay. So um, thumbs up to me from bandai and i honestly honestly think it's definitely definitely worth it uh, 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 as long as you buy it at msrp anything more than msrp it becomes really 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 dodgy all right let's go op04 wow it's been so long we got rabian ipomatsu ice oni Perespero, don quixote la usop sasaki hiyori first rare we got kiros Second rare, we got... Oh, Kinemon, and that's it. Oh, see? It's not all glamorous, but it's okay. OP04, I think, is the worst set out of uh, in terms of value out of all of these. So, um, as long as we hit, we hit bangers in OP05 and 2 and 1, uh, I think that'll be much better. Let's go. We got Daddy. We got Playgrounds. We got Yokozuna. We got Barrier. We got Mr. 3. VV leader, first rare, Mr. Five, second rare, Red Rock. It's actually not bad, not bad. Uh, Red Rock uh, actually has a little bit of value in terms of being a rare. So we struck out with OP04. Hopefully, OP03 will be better. Um, like I said before, I don't mind stri striking out at OP04 because I think that's the worst set out of all three. Obviously, for OP03, uh, the chase here is Manga. Um, who is it? Is it Sogi King? I think it's Sogi King. Um, uh, aside from that, obviously, Katakuri. Katakuri Secret Rare would be pretty amazing as well. Let's go. As we have uh, Jane, we got Minor Rhinoceros. We got Opera. 
Corgi, Garp, Top Knot, Sanji Rare, and Six King Pistol. Oh yeah, I forgot. So um, OP03 and before, they actually include one Dawn uh, as part of the pack. I'm glad they uh, removed that because, um, you know, save uh, tr the trees, you know. It's just going to be such a waste. And it, like, it adds additional weight and, and padding that we don't actually need anymore. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> no hits so far. Uh, I said before, this is kind of the drawback of these kind of products. It's just, it's all random, right? You you might pull a manga card, you might pull nothing, and hopefully this <laughs> this opening, we pull something um, because I'll be pretty, pretty crushed, but it is what it is. All right, next we got um, Nero, we got Wanze, we got Lim. Oh, Kaya, it's actually pretty good. Kaya. That's a rare, uh, definitely has value, definitely has value. Second rare we got, oh, okay, okay. Unfortunately, um, Big Mom, <laughs> uh, Katakuri, actually, I don't know, maybe, is Katakuri getting back at OP08 and 9? Maybe, maybe, so maybe this one is actually a little bit better hit than I thought, but uh, our first hit, semi-hit, you know, with the Big Mom. SR. All right, now we are coming to uh, the better half of the pack opening. Um, I think the best set released in OP0 in the One Piece card game, OP05. I think it's going to get dethroned <laughs> by OP09. Uh, I mean, come on. Golden Manga Pulse? Insane. Insane. All right, let's go. Uh, uh, in terms of actually value right now in marketplace, I believe OP01 has the most value. And then OP05, and then OP02. OP, then OP03, then OP04. I believe that's the secondary market um, price right now. So uh, if you're looking to see uh, which packs that uh, you'd like to get, um, definitely OP05 is up there. All right, we are getting to our first rare. We got Bello Betty. Second rare, we got. Okay, geez. Yikes. It's tough, but that's, that's, that's the. That's the Gamba, that's the Gamba part of it, right? That's, that, that's, that's, that's it. It's just the Gamba part of it. Uh, it's all random. You don't know. Uh, I said before, you can literally open one of these, pull all of the manga cards, uh, all of the SRs, all of the alt arts, or you get absolutely nothing. But I would prefer doing this rather than actually buying loose packs because on the loose packs in the secondary market, uh, we got Sabo Leader here, Hina, and all right, nothing there. Uh, wow, wow, wow. All right, so we have had one SR so far. Tough, tough, tough. We are down to last two. Uh, as I was saying um, before, I prefer doing this, even though it's all random, because if you buy any of loose packs in eBay or in uh, Facebook Marketplace, there's a good chance that they actually uh, are dead packs. And what that means is that a lot of people will just open boxes. And if they pulled all of the hits from that box, they will sell all the other packs. Uh, and yeah, you probably will not get any of the big hits from there. So, you know, keep that in mind if you buy any of the loose packs. Just go buy one of these. Buy um, the treasure box set or buy uh, the double pack ones or the blisters, right? All right, let's go. Next pack, we got Dogura. Croco Boy, we got Usopp, we got Camille, Sento, Franke, Mino Koala, Morley. Wow, it's been so long since I opened OP02. We got Whitebeard. Is he coming back in OP09? Is he coming back? We'll see. We got Mass Deuce 2. And then second rare, we got uh, Lil Sadie. And there's another Don. Oh, wow. This is so tough. So tough. One SR. One SR in seven packs. Yikes. Yikes, double yikes, but it just needs one pull, you know, it just needs one pull. Just give me manga shanks. That'd be pretty cool. Just give me manga shanks. Let's go. Or uh, Dofi leader. That'd be pretty cool too. All right. Next we got, uh, wow, OP01. It's been so long. Such a good ride. Uh, over the year ago, I opened like 30 of these boxes. Let's go. The pre rider ones, blue bottom. Manic. Can you imagine if I save that? be cost like what over forty thousand now probably all right we got shachi we got cavendish pacifista otsuru officer agents neko round table we got komurasaki kaido leader 
first rare we got Momonosuke. Not bad, not bad. And second rare we got... Holy jeez. Wow, 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 wow. But that is the nature of these. I think this is a really, really good example of, uh, you know... That, that's how it is. You know, sometimes you buy this pack, sometimes you get amazing, sometimes you get not, and that's uh, that's the reality of it. So keep that in mind when you're buying these products. These are all gambling and nothing is guaranteed. Um, so yeah, and that's why a lot of people, and me too, uh, I prefer buying sealed boxes. All right, as always, uh, if you want to be part of the giveaway, which is going to be one of these Luffy promo, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. As always, I hope everyone will have an amazing rest of the week, and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.